I want to do a quick try on haul. You guys know I haven't been thrifting for the month of February. Today's February 27th, so I have one more day to go. Um, but I thrifted this trend from the thrift store probably about a month ago. And my intentions were to take it to the tailor to have some alterations done in the leg. But, and I'm still going to do that. But I wanted to do this try on haul with you just so you'll see how easy it is to thrift the trend. So let me show you what it is. So you know that the um, slouchy two piece um, pant sets or suits or however you want to call it are on trend. Now, this is something that I've always been into. I've always gravitated towards men's suits because number one, they fit better overall on a woman, especially if you are a curvier woman. They just, to me, in my opinion, they fit better. So this is not a new thing for me, but it is something that's trending right now. You may have seen some of your favorite celebrities wearing it, some of your fa favorite fashion influencers wearing it. But again, I, but again, I just wanted to show you just how easy it is to thrift those trends. So this is a two-piece men's suit, and I'm gonna come closer so you can see the detail in it. And when I thrifted the suit, I specifically wanted something that had like a plaid um, design to it. So I found this in the thrift store for $7. Um, this is by... Hmm, Kilburn and Fitch. I don't know who that is. I don't really care, but I thrifted it because it fit the design that I was looking for and it was a two-piece men's suit. I'm going to show you two ways to wear this, one with a pair of heels and one with a pair of sneakers. All right, so the first thing I want to do is show you the piece that I'm going to use to layer it. This is a bodysuit that I thrifted from the thrift store. Normally, I would never thrift a bodysuit for obvious reasons. However, when I saw this one, this one still had the tags attached. And um, of course I came home and I washed it and sanitized it really well. But I thrifted this one because number one, it's lace. Lace is never going out of style. It just is here to stay. It has this deep cut neckline and then it has this beautiful tie detail in the back. Now, if you are a more adventurous girl, you can wear this with just a pair of pants, a pair of shorts, a skirt, without having anything to cover it. Or you can do like I'm going to do and use it as a layering piece with a two-piece suit. Now, as I said, I have two different shoe style options. One is a heel. And you see here, I have two different colors. I have an all white Steve Madden heel with the pointy toe. And then I have this silver pair, this silver metallic pair. You guys know metallic was heavily on trend last year. I have had these for probably two years now and I thrifted them because I love the silver color in them and I love how they tie up around the ankle. These were thrifted for $4 and when I thrifted them, it still, it, whoever had them didn't wear them because you can see the price tag was still right there. And this right here that you see is from me wearing them. I got them because of this beautiful silver metallic color. And then these Steve Madden's are not thrifted. However, I did get them um, from Dillard's when they were having a big shoe clearance. I paid $30 for these. Now, the other option that you can use to wear with your suit is just a simple pair of sneakers. These are Jordan 1's. They're blue, black, and white. And you can use these. This is, to me, everybody has something blue, black, and white in their closet. I mean, to me, it's almost like a neutral. But you can see this will pair nicely with that suit. So right off the bat, you can see what I'm talking about with the men's suit. Don't be fooled at the fact that just because it's a men's suit, that it's going to fit you like a man. It is going to adhere to your curves and accentuate the body that you have. I mean... You can see on me, these are men's pants, but if I wore these, you really wouldn't know. So the bodysuit, you can see again, I use this as a layering piece. Here's the back of it. And now I'm gonna put on the jacket. All right, so here is the men's suit. Now what I would do is I would ruch the sleeves, like so, just to give it a little bit more of a feminine look. And what I was gonna do to, when I was going to take this to the tailor is I was going to have her take the shoulder pads out 
and then cinch it just a little bit in the waist. Of course, you don't have to do that. You can just simply belt it, but I was gonna have her cinch it, and then I was gonna have her take the hem out of the pant because the pants are just a tad bit too short. For reference, I'm a 36 or a size 38 in men's, but in the leg, I am a size 32, but I like them a little bit longer, so I will get a 34 or a 36. This is a size 32, so it's fitting me right at the end of my ankle. However, when I wear a heel, it's gonna look a little bit short. So here's the first silver option. You can see it is a nice complement to this men's suit. And then here is the white, which is also a nice complement to the men's suit. All right, so you can see, this isn't the neatest that I could tie it, but just to give you a visual, you can see how I tied it up around the leg of the pant. And like I said, I am gonna have her to take the hem out to make it longer. But this is a nice look. It's a men's suit, but I thimmed it up very quickly with the lace bodysuit, rolled up the sleeves, and threw on a heel. Now let me show you what it looked like with the other shoe and then with the Jordan. All right, here you can see the contrast of how I'm wearing it with a heel, white Steve Madden, versus a Jordan. Verse both look very nice. I haven't thrown on any accessories. So by the time, if I were wearing this out, by the time I really jazz this up, this would be a whole look from head to toe. I may even throw on a fedora with it. I would probably wear a very simple belt, very simple chain, watch, bracelet, earrings, and that's it. If you really want to get jazzy with it, you can cape it. I personally don't like my jacket caped, but you know, that is the it thing to do. So, I mean, you can wear it like this and walk in any room and be a total badass. I thrifted this for $7. The suits that you see that are women's suits that you see in the store, 100, 150. Like I always say, don't sleep on the men's section. I know thrifting may not be a thing for some of you and that's okay but the men's section in general whether it's retail whether it's thrifting whether it's your husband or your boyfriend's closet men's clothes look really good on women i hope i was able to inspire you to try men's clothing you can see just how i have it is really filmed up i mean this bodysuit by itself is really doing it for me child i mean <laughs> it's just what it is so as I said, don't sleep on the men's section. Go and raid your husband's closet. Go raid your boyfriend's closet. Go raid your brothers, your daddies, whomever the man is in your life. Trust me, there are, there are some gems waiting just for you. I hope you all found this informative. Drop down in the comments and let me know what you think. Mm -hmm.